rough every day. Where's my next meal gonna come from? What what am I gonna do? What am I gonna cook? It's awful. Going without hurts, but you just adapt to it. Try to do my best, what we can. And it's me and my husband. Here we have three children at home. Keegan, he's four. Ayla, she's nine. Cheyenne, she's two and a half. And we get a little bit of help for f food stamps, and then WIC, and then the food bank. You know, we need the help. How do you know your neighbor isn't poor? How do you know your neighbor had a good breakfast this morning? Do you know that for sure? And is it your responsibility to take care of your neighbor? We started this year about, well, it'll be 29 years in March. The first year, we, uh, we served about uh, 250 people. And last year, we had 2,566 people get food from the food bank. If you drove into town, you probably wouldn't think anybody was hungry. But yet there's so many people in need. It's amazing how much money it takes today. If they have a car payment, and they got a house payment, and they got, you know, everything paid, and then they get just a little bit over minimum wage and they're driving 30 miles to work, there's just not enough money to go around. I mean, it's just, it's just part of life. When you have people come in and they tell you their stories, you can't turn your back on them. No way could you. No way. My husband works. He's a farmer, truck driver. He's stressed. He tries to do his best for his family and it's, he always feels like just giving up because he works, but yet money-wise coming in is a lot less than what has to go out every month. A lot less. It's never enough to buy groceries and pay for bills. So we always have to subsidize. Either we pay our bills or you know, we, if we pay our bills, we don't eat that good. You know, I always try to make sure that supper is our big thing before we go to bed. I try to have whatever we have, a lot of, you know, each, so their tummies are full when they go to bed. Kids eat, I mean, it's not like we, it's not like my kids starve, you know. Yes, they're, it might be little, you know, but they're not exactly starved. Right here. I mean, I, we try to do our best for our children, but it's not enough.